All right, hey guys, Dub here. Welcome back to another video. Um, today I'm going to be doing something that I really didn't want to do because I mean it's it's really useless. It's like nobody's gonna use this, but I figured I'd record it anyways because why the fuck not? I mean, I upload the same shit all the time, so putting out something different. And yeah, so today I'll be going through my Cicada config and maybe just a few tips on how to use it. I mean, it's it's been around forever. I understand to a lot of you out there who say this to me all the time, you use the most fucking leaked and skidded client in the entire world. You are a retard, IXOR. What are you fucking doing? Dub, you dumbass. Well, it is. It's a very leaked and... S oh shit, my FPS. It is a very leaked and skidded client. But it's good for a very outdated and shitty no cheat, which is MindZ and Shopo in general. And I mean, that's fine. Use it for that, but it's useless on everything else. So this config video, kind of useless. I don't know what you guys are going to do with it, especially because my config is rather weird. But yeah, I'm just going to get started, and I'm recording this all in my first take. So if I fuck up at all, I don't give a fuck. I won't edit it out. You can have fun making fun of me for it, but yeah, whatever, so I'm gonna get right into it. Alright, so for all the uh, render stuff, like, um, Tracer, ZSP, there's so much render shit in this client, like, I don't know if you can see it right, but all of this shit right here, it's all render. And I've been kind of cutting down on how many modules I have listed on the side of my screen, because I used to have a big ass list, and it kind of looks the. So, anyways, uh, by pressing I... I turn on no fall zoot ESP bright item ESP tracer. That's not really it though. I also, as you can see in chat, I turn on anti potion, shams, um, no bob, no weather, waypoints, all that kind of stuff. Um, some of the stuff isn't really listed on the array list on the right side of the screen, but yeah. So um, let me see. Uh, some of the ways you'll see my me set up is I'll use Hysteria with the info box on the right side like this or I'll use IX with the info box on the left side of the screen under the IX with the time but I like the info box I'm just I'm kind of OCD about using it so that's kinda of why um, alright so that stuff's my first that's the first stuff I use I put on now I have um, Sprint it's R okay now I'm gonna get into the weird shit because a lot of you who use any clients even if it was like before where you just use an old client your kill aura key is most likely R that is not the case for me that is not my kill aura key sprint is my R so that's what I do to turn sprint on now for speed it's Z caps or speed is set for Z yeah weird as fuck probably gonna get a lot of that um alright uh what else okay so for the four uh, big movement ones that you want to make sure you have binded for this client it goes um, I have like a group of four, so it's like a little square on my keyboard. It goes K for anti-velocity, M for step, J for Jesus, and N for no slowdown. So those are the four ones that I'll put on. Usually I don't keep step on because it slows you down when you're next to blocks, as you can see right here. And now I'm going a bit faster. So that helps when you're like on top of the walls in Hasa, like I'll turn step off. And you can, you can see a lot of my clips, I don't even have step on at all. Even when I should have it on, I just don't because it slows you down. So that's that's it for that. Now my I used to have kill aura and crits or IXOR and crits, whatever the fuck, on one key. It's not the case anymore. Uh, crits is C. Um, sometimes I use aura on other servers. I mean, like I don't really do it on. Sometimes I use it on GG because it's OP as hell. But aura is V, and IXOR, which is one you'll see me use the most, is B. So yeah, my kill aura key is B, which is fucking weird. A lot of other people have it as R, so. So yeah, and then my ice speed and ladder is U. Um, for the step bypass, I turn, uh, I press Y, that turns no cheat off. Then I'll take damage a bunch and step up. Um, my damage key is H. It doesn't do anything in a single player world, but you can see uh, damage works. It's like a fall damage thing. And then my flight key is F, like pretty much a lot of other people. And then my glide key is G. For um, glide on Mine Z, you want to have your glide speed set at 0 0.04. 
uh, kill aura settings. I keep the rotation and hit speed at their highest settings because those will still bypass fine. And I never keep my range anywhere above like 5 or like 620. Those are the, that's what I normally keep to on my kill aura. So yeah, um, normal aura will tend to hit at least a few NPCs and it can get you banned if you're like hitting a large group of people. So again, I recommend using IX aura. Otherwise, normal aura is really kind of OP. Like the range works really well and it hits through walls. So yeah, and then um, that's really pretty much it. Um, a few helpful commands. I'll blink right here. As you can see, the ESP is full there. Um, if you want to learn anything about any of the modules, you go, for example, I'll use ESP, ESP space O list. And this exam, for example, that will work for everything. So, like, if I go Jesus O list, it'll list all the options for settings on that. Really, don't change anything when it comes to that. But like, ESP O list, it says inner and aura. Aura basically makes it so that when I have aura locked on to a target, it'll turn the ESP will flash red. So if you basically if you set uh, dash ESP space set um, aura true, that's what it will do. Oh, one sec. All right. So as you can see, when the aura is on the uh, target now, even if it's not actually doing any damage to it, it will turn. It will start flashing red. Now to turn that off, for example, it will be ESP set aura false. My keyboard's going to be really loud in this, so so yeah, ESP set aura false. See, as you see, the ESP uh, stays green, and if you want that enabled again, you just type the same command, and now it's set to true. And then if you don't want like the fill like that, which I don't know why, it looks kind of cool, uh, you just go ESP set inner false, and now it doesn't fill, and you can see it's just the lines, and yeah, but I like to keep mine filled. So I'll just turn that back on. Um, so that's that's pretty much it. I mean, there's really not much more to this client. It has a shitload of other random stuff that I recommend not using. The auto pot doesn't work that well. It's, just, it's probably one of the biggest waste of pots in the game, in any client ever. Um, really, that's all. There's not much. It's just Cicada. It's just for Mind Z. Don't use it anywhere else. It'll be banned. None of the modules will work. Use other clients, and I mean I've tried using Serenity before, but it's just it's not for MindZ. It's for it's for like HCF servers. It's not. But yeah, so to those who bitch at me constantly for using skidded clients, it's just you just you just giving me excuses. Like come on, I'm not gonna stop hacking. I'm not gonna change. Nothing's gonna happen. So fuck off. It pff, it's Cicada. This is the only server it's good for, and. When people like Magic House say they take pride in a no sheet that allows me to take damage four times and fly up a wall, it's you legits should be insulted because Magic House doesn't play enough to be killed by hackers like that. He doesn't know what it's like, so I don't know. Just that's pretty much it. I could just rant out on about everything forever, but I don't want to upload like a ten thousand year video. So that's it. Um, I'll be uploading more hacking montages, obviously. I'll laugh my ass off if I get to a hundred. Basically, if they update their note sheet, I'm just gonna leave and quit, and it'll be done. Won't I won't find new clients? I'll just quit. And that's that'll be the end of it. But that's something they're never gonna do. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. There's only like three, four, or five people who asked me for this config video. I didn't really want to make one because my config is extremely weird, and I it didn't I didn't think it was gonna be that useful. And I and to be honest, half the time I can't tell if they're asking for a content video or if they're just asking for a bypass video. So if you want a bypass video, if any of you are interested in knowing what to do for all the bypasses, I can make one, sure as hell. But honestly, just it's up to you. Like, I'll, otherwise I'll just upload the same shit, hacking montages every fucking day, every other day. So yeah, again, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll be releasing more packs. And I'm Dub, I'm out, see ya.